Okay, I have a, I have a question. Can you, can you hear me in the back? Yes, okay. I have a question that includes the band members. Tell me the name of the so-called classical composition that this tune, Papiam Pam 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 Para, is being used. No? No take no takers? Just a segment of it, nothing big. Pum 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 ping pum 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 American in Paris by George Gershwin. Okay, anyway, now you know. <laughs> Let's see. Our next composition is interesting. Because the composer says that uh, Scandia, that's the name of the composition, is a descriptive overture, a painting of the uh, mysteriously beautiful Scandinavian countries. Well, I've never been there, so I don't know. And it's also used as some folk melodies and also the, uh, the regal theme of King Charles. So this is something called Scandia by a composer of Rolf Berman. I'm not sure if you heard about it, neither did I, but actually it's very nice. <coughs>
Mentioning the name George Gershwin, our next two numbers were written by George Gershwin, but not for me, and Embraceable You. So please welcome again our magnificent soprano, Nancy Davis Booth. Yeah. Although 
know, so many of you wanted to buy Laszlo's book that he sold out tonight. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So uh, what are you going to do about that, Laz? Well, if they name the names and addresses, I will mail it to them. I'm s serious. I'm very, I will do it. Or come to the Pops concert tomorrow night. Okay. Th that's or come cool. to my house. <laughs> I live in Budapest. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> okay, what a smarty. <laughs> All right. Uh, now the second Gershwin tune. Th these, both these tunes were uh, written by the brothers. Uh, Ira wrote the lyrics and George wrote the tune. I think that that pairing is just so very special. The tunes that come from the two of them just seem to fit hand in glove. of you have come up from the audience to remind me of who you are and I, I'm so touched. I mean, I ran into Marie who was my OBGYN nurse when I had Aaron. I mean, you <laughs> never know who you're going to meet here. Yeah, it's my gynecologist here. No, okay, that's a good thing. It's, it's fantastic. Thank you so much for coming up and, and remembering me and reminding me who you are. It's just, it's, I'm, I'm very touched. It's wonderful. It's a wonderful homecoming. <laughs> okay, let's move on. 
Ah, uh, la vie en rose. When I am in your arms, I feel the rosy life. Words by Edith Piaf. Baiser le mien, un rire qui se perd sur sa bouche. Voilà le potre sans retouche. Quel homme oh, que j'appartiens. Quand il me prend de ses bras, il me parle tout bas. Je vois la vie en Well, this is my last tune for tonight, and before I sing it, I would just like to thank Laszlo for inviting me to appear with this wonderful ensemble. Tucson should be very, very proud. <coughs> And you know, this doesn't happen by accident. So uh, look in your program and you can become a donor and uh, that would be a very special thing because otherwise it just won't happen. And you know, when you look back across the, the history of the United States, the band in the park in the summer is like the thing. And we don't want that to go away because it's obviously a very special thing to the audience and also to the players as well. So it's, um, it's a wonderful thing. So become a donor and thank you for all of your uh, participation and your support. And thanks to Tucson Parks and Rec and to all the corporate sponsors as well. It's a fantastic thing. I should have you back more often. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
So um, this is Dorothy's big aria from The Wizard of Oz, Somewhere Over the Rainbow. And second time around, I would very much like for you to sing with me. OK? Dorothy. Do you know why Dorothy got lost over there in The Wizard of Oz? No, Laszlo. Why did Dorothy get lost in The Wizard of Oz? Because three men gave her directions. <laughs> but I bumped. <laughs> uh, when all the clouds darken up the sky, we there's a Just a step beyond the rain, somewhere over the rainbow, way up high, there's a
Thank you so much. One more time for Nancy Davis, both. Nancy. Like I said, she's going to sing the same program tomorrow night with the Tucson Pops at Reed Park. <clears throat> and I know many of you go to both of the concerts. Thank you, Nancy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You were great. Um, since this is our final concert of the spring, I have to remind everybody, please, if you enjoy our concerts over here, take two minutes of your time and write a little postcard to your council, council people, city council people, yeah. And um, just let them know how much you enjoyed at the, all the concerts given by the Symphony Queens at Udall Park. If you don't like it, don't say anything so we can do this thing more. This is our 17th year over here. Believe it or not, this is our 131st free concert at this park. That's an incredible number, really is. Well, what to follow after Nancy's beautiful singing. By the way, they were just great. Um, a little klezmer music. There you go, a little upbeat.
the Russian composer Peter Ilyich Tchaikovsky wrote lots of compositions and we are going to play for you the finale from Symphony Number no. 4. It's a, it's a celebration, that's what it is. He always enjoyed being a child. He always found pleasure in children. He always told people, when you are done in art, all you have to do is just go to the park and observe how young people are. And that's what he's doing. And this is the finale from S Symphony Number no. 4 by Tchaikovsky.
The music of Tchaikovsky is always exciting. All right, we have some names to pull. All right, we are going to pull how many? Five. Five. All right, five. Chi 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 Would you like to pull one? Okay, um, if I call your name, please, after the concert, come up over here and get your gift certificate. The worst, first one is uh, George W. Bush. <laughs> Are you here? <laughs> okay, it's Marianne Anderson. Marianne, after the concert, please come down. Byron Skinner. Byron Skinner. 
number two. Norma Metzen. Norma Metzen. Arturo Toscanini. <laughs> okay, I think it's Linda Plazak. Plizak? Plizak? Anyway, it's Linda. <laughs> and your phone number starts with 885. Okay. And John Kingery. And no phone number. John, John Kingery. Thank you for uh, participating. Thank you for being here. And um, we had such a magnificent soloist tonight. There's no way. Oh. That was a treat, really was, for all of us. Thank you, Nancy. Thank you for being here. And believe me, without the band behind me, there would be no music in the park. So thank you, Symphonic Winds. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. 
And those of you who think it's hot, just remember there are no mosquitoes.